Stella begins with, um, with this guy, who's my son Curtis. He's cute, right? Um, so Curtis, he's a great kid. Uh, he's my middle son. He's, and he's great at a lot of things, but he's not so great at reading. And I met with this principal uh, a couple years ago to figure out what could be done to help Curtis. Curtis goes to school in New York City, at public school PS101 in Queens, where all kids are rated on a four-point scale. Or advanced slides. Oh, there you go. So, all right. So Curtis is a. Uh, so there's a four-point scale on reading. Four means you're just not out of the park. Three means you're on track. Well, Curtis was a two, and that he wasn't on track. So I met with Curtis's principal, and she says, you know, there's 30 kids in the class, and there's just one teacher. We just don't have the tools that we need to differentiate for every single one. And then she says to me something that I will never, ever forget. She says, we're going to do what we can for Curtis, but some kids are just going to be a two. So I, I was angry, and I was just thrushed. Um, and how could an educator give up on a child, or, or any child for that matter? Um, but it is true that teachers just don't have the tools that they need, and I wanted to do something about it. And that's why we created Newzella. So Newzella uses daily news and personalization to help anyone become a master reader. Anyone. So here's how it works. We take daily news from top news sources, including the Los Angeles Times, uh, the Associated Press, now Scientific America that was just announced, and then we publish articles across a variety of subjects, from science to social studies, and the arts, and so on. But then we do something else. Every single article is published at five reading levels. Every single article at five reading levels, from grade three all the way up to an adult level. Got it? So our software is adaptive. It's constantly seeking out each student's just right reading ability and then automatically gives them the level of the article that's just right for them. But at the same time, this is really important, students have the power to change the article level with a single click. Not this click, but a single click. They can actually. Uh, so, so that's Muzella. So the, the power is that struggling, uh, I'm going to ask these guys to click if I can click, is that struggling, on track and advanced readers. They can all read the same great nonfiction content together while each having the power to learn at their own pace. So now one of, one of my favorite parts of Newzella is the formative assessment tool. You should never have to wonder what's going on with your students' reading. So we follow along with students' results on common core aligned quizzes. They're modeled after SBAC that are taught that are tied to most of our articles. We also look at their annotations, their time on task, and so on. And we put all of this information together to provide a rich picture of your students to help you improve your instruction and to help them improve their reading. So that's Newzella. So LA teachers have helped Newzella become one of the fastest growing tools in the history of education technology. We have about 20,000 students and teachers registering through Newzella every day for free. Um, and they're doing it because of the Common Core's transition to a focus on nonfiction literacy, which I'm sure all of you are struggling with, and also the ability to drive literacy across the curriculum, that it can be used in any subject so all of your teachers can get together and figure out what's going on with the students that they have in common. So that's how I want to help students like Curtis, help all those 20 million students around the country, and help yours. Um, this is Newzella. This is how you reach us, and please visit us at our table today. Thank you very much.